Hello everybody, it's Wendy and we've just finished our unit meeting and I thought that I would give you just a really quick synopsis of what we covered in case you couldn't be part of it. Um, the webinar went really, really well and you can all get a look at that as soon as I take the time to put it up online and then give you a link to it. So that I won't cover. But while we were as a unit, we covered some other things that were on our agenda. So where was my agenda? We covered bookings training. A few of you asked us to write down what we covered, and um, I might scan this document that Camille helped us with, but really we went through some booking tips. Before the party, what you should do. During the party, what you should do. And then after the party, what you can do in order to improve your bookings. So before the party, you were to check in the mirror before you leave home and make sure that you would want to buy from you. Um, we also thought that you could create a couple of booking bags, two or three bookings bags, and have those ready to give to your hosts, your future hosts, when they book a party. And putting the $50 vouchers, um, sticking that to the outside of the bags and making it look really, really good and positive. And then one of our, um, one of the additional things we said you could do is just pop a tea light into the bag as well and give it a little gift to it. We also said that you should check your Perfect 10 display and make sure it contains at least one wow piece and that it sparkles. Well, that makes a lot of sense. Um, during the party, we said that you should refer to your booking bag and mention that everything you need to get your party started is in there and you can get your $50 voucher as well. Uh, distribute wish lists to people and um, there were some ideas there about having a wish list at the top and having your calendar at the bottom of a page that you would hand out. And uh, several people thought that was a good idea. We also um, said that you should invite every single guest to host a party. And we talked about that quite a bit. Um, and if you believe in 10-3-2, you recognize that you're going to get seven people at every party who say, no, they don't want to have a party. And that's good. As long as you're asking everybody so that the three people who do want to have parties in the future are, are uncovered. And you can only discover them if you ask everybody. And then after the party, um, building a relationship with your customers by calling them just after the party, maybe the next day, and saying, thank you for coming, and um, really enjoyed meeting you. Everything's been ordered and will be delivered directly to your host, and I just wanted to say how great it was to meet you. It opens the door for you to start a conversation with them about anything. And um, sometimes it's a closed door. Sometimes they just say thank you very much and you hang up but it always is a feel-good call because you're not asking for anything in return. Starting the relationship makes it easier to continue the relationship. So, um, I think we clarified as well after the webinar a little bit more about how to order the $5 tea lights. And in particular, we just wanted to make it really clear that you cannot process an order just for one box of $5 tea lights. Or, if you do, you're going to be charged a $15 shipping fee. So you do need to make sure that you actually process it as a total order and maybe look at your client service calls that you're making. Have a few customers that are on an order, an outside order, and then add some of your new customers to this. Um, and we did some really good breakout sessions. And um, let's see, Catherine asked me to take notes on what people said. Oops. Um, I might get to that and probably do it um, over the Facebook page. And um, I think that's about it. I'm super excited about the Grand Parade and the number of people from the Nirvana region, the future Nirvana region, who are going to be part of that. And um, I'll just have a look at my agenda over here. We did bookings training. We talked about light up the streets. Our recognition was really good for March. That was fantastic. Um, we went over the May specials and uh, we talked a lot about conference and uh, really wanting everybody who is intending to go to conference to just register, just register now, sign up for Stash Cash, put it in your diary, read the terms and conditions and register um, because you, you won't regret it once you go and it's the most amazing um, and positive experience I can, I can recommend. Uh, it's the way I started my party light career was going to a conference in my first month and um, I've never looked back after that. So 
Um, I hope you have a great day. Have a great week. Finish off April strong and uh, have a fantastic May. It's our birthday month. Um, we are going to be able to give away some tea lights to people who've never heard of us before. Hopefully turn that into a few parties. And everybody who buys tea lights in May is going to be getting a fantastic offer for a free glow light jar in June or July if they host a party. And uh, that, that seems like an amazing uh, way to, to fill up your calendar as we go into conference. Anyway, hope you have a great time, have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you.